Good morning, my friends. Today, I'm gonna to be following you, no, you're gonna be following me around with me on my day. That made no sense. You guys know what I'm trying to say. I don't know what I'm trying to say. You guys are gonna be following me around my day. I do have my Invisalign in, so I have a bit of a lisp at the moment, but I'm about to um, make breakfast for everyone. Just realized we have no bananas, so Jay's gonna run and grab some bananas real quick. He doesn't know it yet, but I'm gonna tell him. I need to switch out my hummingbird feeder. So we make nectar, which is basically just sugar water, because we have a little hummingbird that visits us, which is really exciting. Can go outside? Girls, come on. She almost biffed it. <laughs> you coming? Come on, let's go outside. I know you haven't gone potty yet. Come on. Hey, good girl. Okay, you coming out, Tiddlywinks? And you're just going to block the door? Okay. Come on. You're letting all the air conditioning out. Are you going to move or what? Are you going to come out? Oh, what a pain in the bum. Okay, anyway. I have to water my plants today. Oh, it's gotten all humid out here. Sorry, the camera's fogging up. This is our little... Oh, God, you guys cannot see a thing. How sad is that? It's so humid out here. We'll go back in and it will defog. This is our little humm hummingbird feeder. We got it. Is it gonna defog now? Yeah, I think slowly but surely it is. We got it from Lowe's and it is so cute. And it actually has like a little solar light as well. So it lights up at nighttime, which is really fun. We just refill it every day. Um, and the reason is because they can actually get moldy in there and then that can be harmful to your hummingbirds. So you wanna just change, so we change out every single morning and we just keep it in the fridge in these little Tupperwares. So I just like rinse everything off, make sure there's no yucky grossies in there. My little sugar water. And hopefully this will be enough. Sugar water. <laughs> okay, is it gonna squirt out on me today? Not today. You have to make sure that your little flowers are set up to where the perches are because this is where the little perch is and then she can sit here and then stick her little what's it in there. She can drink to her heart's content. Let's make sure it's all evened up here. There we go. Oh, that's looking a little crooked. You cannot chew a muffin. Um, Phoenix has a loose tooth, so he can't eat really anything at the moment because it's hurting. Um, so he wants to eat a chocolate muffin. I had a muffin before. And I wanted fine. donuts. No. Oh yeah, she's wearing a donut dress. Yes, donut. Um, we're gonna have acai bowls. If you don't want acai bowl, I can make you a smoothie. Mm. That's your choice. But I don't want a smoothie. <gasps> Mommy, well, smoothies are acai bowls in a cup. Exactly. Hi everybody, it's me. We're making acai bowls. They're my favorite. Oh, bye. Lily is gonna be my cameraman. Okay, we've got our strawberries. We do have one banana. One banana. One, just the one. Hi, yeah. And now these strawberries. Yeah, we need our acai. Yeah, I, I kind of have to chew this. No, you don't have to chew. Oh, yeah, babe. Yeah, I do. Babe, you don't need to chew oatmeal, okay? Baby, you're not gonna choke on oatmeal, it's oatmeal. Um, yeah, then no chance. Phoenix, you can't choke on oatmeal, buddy. You can't. Yeah, <laughs> no, you can't. Very easy to choke on it. Maybe if you're like one, you're, you're almost 10. Mm, you can still choke on it. Okay, I don't think so. We just recently got the unsweetened and then we mix with the regular. That way it's like we have half and half because just this alone I feel like isn't quite as yum. Mm -mm. But this is really good. So mm -hmm. we just kind of do both. That mm -hmm. way we have like half 
unsweetened and half sweetened. So we just do two of the, well actually Phoenix isn't having one, is he? Mm -hmm. we do one. Normally we do four packs for all of us. We gotta do three? No, I'll just give daddy an extra big one. He'll eat it. So we'll do four packs. So two packs of the unsweetened and then two packs of the original blend. So we do one cup of blueberries for four people. Normally if it's just for like me and Jay, then I would just do half of everything. So normally I do two bananas, four packs, one cup of blueberries, and then, oh, I forgot to do my almond milk. Mm -hmm. Or my coconut milk, I think. So this is the coconut milk right here. It's the So Delicious Dairy Free Organic Coconut Unsweetened. So I do up to the 50 mark. I made a triangle. So yeah, it's up to like half. So I don't know how much that is on here, but there we go. I'll add one more banana once he gets back. I'll add my blueberries. Oh good, the banana man is here. So we're gonna put in our other banana. Our Aussie packs did not even melt at all. So we're gonna put those underwater just for like 30 seconds. And then it just kind of softens them up a little bit because they are so frozen. So see, you just go one, two. And press frozen desserts. And then you just have to give it a good smash. Ta-da. Done. It's the person oh, oh, from up. Yeah, from up. It's the up guy, the old man. Yep. Gosh, I love that movie. It makes me cry every time. What's yeah, that guy's it's name? It's Kevin? What's the bird's name? I don't know. Is it Kevin? I think it's something like that. Kevin? Kevin! I think it's Kevin. Ooh. Mmm, it looks like toffee pudding. Mm -hmm. Mama, I want raspberries. Mine. Oh, you want raspberries? Yeah. As well as strawberries? Yes. Let's do Lily's first. Yeah. She gets to go first. So we're gonna stick our banana in. And our strawberries. Just like that. And then. And then we're gonna put our strawberries. Most wonderful. Okay, why don't you grab some raspberries and wash oh. them for me? Okay. I like the when the little bits are like big. <laughs> Fiona, shush it. Oh, is he such a good girl? Yeah, Fiona's. Yeah. Fiona's our naughty one. Okay, now you've got raspberries as well. And Posey doesn't whine at all. Yeah, Posey's very well behaved. Posey okay, likes... Okay, you want to grab me a fork? Lily likes a little drizzle of chocolate. Okay, Doak, there is Lily's acai bowl. You are ready to go. I'll meet you outside. We like the Good and Gather Organic Honey Almond Granola. Then we add a little bit of cacao nibs. Fiona, shush. Quiet. And then Jay likes a honey. He doesn't want Nutella on it. There is my beautiful acai bowl. I'm gonna go ahead and have my little superberry dietary supplement from Care-of, and then I'm also gonna have my vitamins for the morning. So these are little like boosts that you can add to their protein or collagen. I don't actually have any protein or collagen from them, so I just like have it as just the boost. And you just put it in water, and they come in these little, sachets so they're really convenient you can take them with you if you want to and like I said you can add these to a protein a collagen your smoothie I could technically put these in my acai um, but I just put it in water like this and I've been taking these um, they're just recent um, so not too long but so far I'm really liking them it comes with a little booklet so you take a quiz um, on the website it's super duper easy to do and they ask you a bunch of stuff about like your routine, your, you know, what your health goals are, what your exercise looks like. It makes it super personalized, which is awesome. So if you just go to takecareof.com and use the code Samantha S50 in all capital letters, that will save you guys 50% off of your first order. You get these little packs like this. And so like this is your box and it just says care of. And then you get this little individual pack for each day that says your name on it, and then it says a quote. So this one says, I am no longer accepting the things I cannot change. I am changing the things I cannot accept. And then it tells you um, like your expiration date and then what is how many pills you have. And then you've got your four little vitamins. In each of my packs, I have the vitamin C, which is the citrus savior, and this t helps to maintain a healthy immune system. Then we have Asta, oh gosh, Astaxanthin, I have no idea how you say that guys. This is the Coral King, this supports cognitive health. Then we have the Veggie Omega 
um, and this is the veg out. This helps maintain cognitive health. These are like extra battery, like a booster. And then we have the super berry, which is supposed to support vascular health. So that's kind of like my little formula of what they prescribed to me when I did the quiz. They have really high quality. There's a ton of science and research behind their vitamins. Um, and they just, I think the fact that they make it so personalized is really, really cool. And you get, 30 packs, so that's a full month. They are eco-friendly, so these are actually compostable. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and pour it into my water. Oh, so I do have a coupon code that's gonna save you guys 50% off of your first order with Care Of. I will go ahead and have a link down below for you guys so that you guys can just easily click on it in the description box as well as in my comment section. Um, but yeah, so I will basically drink this with my vitamins. It's super subtle. There's like a hardly any hint, but it tastes really natural and like not um, syrupy or fake or like too sweet. So it's really nice. What I get in my pack is not going to be the same as what you get in your pack because you're going to have different things that you're wor like worried about or focusing on. And then it tells you about each little vitamin. So I like the fact that you see exactly what is in them. You have all the ingredients listed. You have the percentage um, the milligram amount of all of the stuff that comes in your care pack and I just keep mine like right here in my little tea station so that I can grab it in the morning if I do um, This is usually where I grab a cup to get water and then I can just take my vitamins for the day So that's what I've recently started taking as far as vitamins and so far I'm really liking them I mean um, vitamins are kind of tricky because I feel like it's one of those things that takes a minute You know for you to really notice but I will say that um, I haven't had any bad experiences so far, um, so that's good. And I do love the fact that it is custom for what I wanted and what I said that I like was looking for out of a vitamin. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave that link down below. You don't have to buy everything they recommend. Obviously they give you, here's what we recommend that you get, but you don't have to necessarily buy every single item that they recommend, or you can, and then you can get the maximum out of the health benefits of the little kind of packet that they put for you. So you guys should definitely check it out. I love the Superberry. If you can get, if you get recommended the Superberry, I highly recommend it because it is really lovely. This oh, did she come? Oh, she came for like 30 seconds. Oh, bummer, I missed her. This is what we do, we sit out here. We eat our acai bowls together. Usually Phoenix has one as well, but you know, the tooth. And we wait for our hummingbird. Oh, and Mom, I think that the coolness would, would also be like... Oh, on his tooth? Yeah, maybe so. How is it? So good. Do you love it? Thank you. This is our favorite part of our day, isn't it? Sitting outside eating our acai bowls. She it makes us feel like we're on vacay. Was she? Yeah, she was there for, oh. she was there for 35 seconds. I'm jelly. Mm. Dude, Super jelly. In, in that one right there. Did you change it out? Yeah, I did. I changed it this morning. Okay, guys, we are going for our morning bike walk. The kids usually slack in the back because it's so hot they complain the entire time. It's a good little bit of exercise in the morning. I'm actually burning up. It's supposed to be, a, what did it, she say, a heat index of 105 today? Yeah. Miserable. With probably 87% humidity, so it's just horrible. You're on camera. They're watching you. They're not even listening to me, guys. Get closer so you can get in the frame with me. Ah, we fell in a ditch. Ah, what you doing, Luna? Hi. You come out now that the donkeys are away? What you doing? The donkeys, she hears them. She's like, oh gosh, where are they? Oh, you hear them, don't you? She's like, I'm going upstairs. Those dogs are super annoying. <laughs> it is so hot, so <laughs> today we our- this pool, it's amazing. So yeah, we've set up our little umbrella. Oh, see if Posey oh, wants to go swimming. Does she, oh, cool. Put her in, let's see if she'll go swimming. <laughs> <laughs> Is that fun? Can get it? Ah. Yeah. Oh no, maybe she doesn't oh, want to. Baby. Is that fun, Posey Poo? <laughs> Put her down. Let's see what she does. She's always trying to get in the water. Oh, is that fun? <laughs> Fiona. 
Do you want to get into it, Fiona? Is that fun, Cozy? Do you like it in there? What are you? Is that fun? Her little chicken legs. <laughs> anyway, so yeah. Um, this pool is amazing. It's by Mini Dip. We got it from Target. Okay, I'm fast now. <laughs> See if Oni wants to get in there. I don't think Oni will. Put her in, let's see what she does. She's like, oh gosh, no, please don't. <laughs> like the baby's cold. She done. They'll dry off. It's nice and hot. The baby was oh, cold. are you gonna shake off? Mama, the baby got cold. Did she? Got cold. The baby. Oh look, she has a mohawk now. Can Jay. Sit out yeah, do you want me to sit out on the patio table? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'll get my, my stuff set up and then I can edit while you guys play. I'll just put some shorts on though because these pants are sweating my bum off. <laughs> Wanted to show you guys, look at our grapefruit tree. Look at this thing. That is like substantial. I'm quite impressed. And then we've got another one growing over there. And then just like little tiny ones. This tree is doing really, really well. That's our crepe myrtle. He's doing quite well. We put these ones out here because they were looking a bit sad. We thought they needed more sun. Um, but everything else is doing really, really well. This one is an orange tree. Got some little bits and bobs here and there. Nothing major like the grapefruit one though. <laughs> They're having so much fun. Oh my god, that was amazing. My hummingbird, you guys got to see my hummingbird. She was here for so long, she's having a drink. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Burning my thumb off, I she can't hear you. These things are so good. These are phoenixes from school, and like, he let me use them, and they're amazing, because the dogs chewed my other ones. Um, the kids are still in the pool. They're having the time of their life. I am just editing. So Jay is scheduling all of these. We have like all these repairs from, Basically, when you, have, when you have a new build, you have all of these things that are not right. Um, not, it's nothing major, it's just like little bits and bobs. Because of COVID, everything got pushed back, and so we have just a ton of stuff that needs to be fixed. So he's like been dealing with that all morning, trying to get everyone scheduled, and you know, this person comes on, like we have plumbing coming out, and then they have to redo our siding, and like there's all these things to be done. So yes, I have a few videos that I need to edit. I have the one that I have been working on for months now. Um, it's a, a special video, um, but we have so much footage. It was, so it's something to do with my bestie, so I'll give you a, a hint at that. Um, but I traveled to Florida first, and then I traveled out to Tahoe recently to do it. Um, but I literally have like hours and hours worth of footage So I've been putting it off because I'm like, oh my gosh, it's gonna take forever But I need to like just knuckle down and get it done because it is due Next week, so I need to start working on that and then I need to get my Walgreens thumbnail sorted out so I need to go find my phone because I've lost it I have to get all my videos scheduled and all that kind of stuff and then tomorrow I have an Instagram campaign I'm working on I have a meeting to go and work or um, pick up my, um, I got my ring redone with a local jeweler here in town who is amazing. I'm super excited, I can't wait, because I basically got the diamond that was like in my engagement ring and we reset it into a setting that will actually match like the gold, so I can't wait for that. And then I have a phone meeting, and so I just have like a lot of stuff going on. So they're just gonna go ahead and literally become prunes in this swimming pool all day long and uh, they're like having the time of their life. The dogs are running around like crazy. There she goes. There's Fiona Oni. What does she have? She has a stick. Oni Oni. Oni Oni Oni. She's so fast. Can't even catch her. Where's Posey? Oh, there she is. What's she doing, Posey? Oh, she's gonna go get her. They're chasing each other with a stick, I think. Oh my gosh, that is plenty full. He's making them cold. I'm not surprised. You're, I'm turning you off. Okay, you're officially turned off and very full. You guys have plenty of water in there. No, don't let her in. She's all dried off now. Look how cute your little swimsuit is. Woo, cutie patootie. Now you guys don't even have to be hot. I like better in the sun because I'm cold. Oh, do you want to put the umbrella up or down? 
You guys too, are you too cold? Let me put this down. <gasps> oh, I don't know how to. Oh, here we go, I did it. Okay, there we go. Now you guys can have some sun. <laughs> there, you can warm up and then I'll put it back up in a little bit. How's that? Is that better? Okay. Okay guys, so I've just realized that I've literally been like sucked into my computer for the entire day and I didn't even like eat lunch. Oh, you're blocking my light. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, cool. Um, I didn't even eat lunch. So, bit of a fail there, but I got super sucked into editing. I'm editing this project that is a lot. It's a lot of work. So. I, my day just kind of got the best of me today. Um, but we are here to eat dinner now. Mm -hmm. We've got some broccoli. By the way, we eat the most random things because um, vegetarian life is not the easiest. It's fun. It's fun, we like it. We're not very traditional as far as meals go no. anymore. It took a long time to get used to At it. At first he was like having a hard time. Because I'm very traditional in the Meat, protein, potatoes. protein, starch, whatever. But like I, I enjoy just eating Random. Yeah, now we're super random. So, we're having broccoli, some guacamole, and some nachos. It's basically just cheese and chips what? and black beans. What is a black, oh, black. black beans, yeah, and tomatoes. Those are little bugs. So, yeah, those are some little cricket bodies we found. For the bugs we found in the backyard. Remember yeah. in a, the candy store at Letterland, they like sell candy cricket stuff. Oh, candy. yeah. Did you guys want those? No. They um, were just, they you don't were... want to get them for you for Christmas? Uh-uh. Okay. Well, we'll have to take them back I think then. they're real, actually. They were. Maybe. I don't know, I've never had them. The kids are having spaghetti and broccoli. Well, he, he did. Phoenix is currently not eating anything because his tooth is loose. And he wouldn't eat his broccoli because he said it was making his tooth wiggle. We want a Vitamix his entire meal. We're just gonna stick it all in the little baby blender. <laughs> <laughs> Should we go back to baby food? That'd be so cool. Yeah. Oh, let's do it. You'll get all your vitamins and minerals. Mm -hmm. Do it, do it. So basically, um, everyone finger, keep your fingers crossed that Phoenix's tooth comes out. I really hate loose teeth. I can't wait for the day that the kids are over having loose teeth because they're stressful. If it was happening to me, I'd be miserable as well. So it's not that they're like being dramatic about it. It's just that it's wiggly teeth suck. It's one of my last ones that's fun. Well, I think you're supposed to lose your molars, aren't you? Mm -hmm. And you got a lot of those. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know anything about teeth. All I know is that I had many toothaches growing up and I had Invisalign and I still have Invisalign every night and my teeth hurt every single night that I put my Invisalign in and teeth are a pain in my bum. I wouldn't eat anything when we lose our mol molars. I'm what are you going to do? You're going to have to drink everything through a straw. Well, we'll have to like... Buy to mix your meal. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to get baby food for you guys. No! No. Yeah. Anyway, I'm hungry. I'm gonna eat. Oh, look at Jay. He's really. Oh, look at you, babe. Really making it look beautiful. Oh, every, every bite has is, is perfect. Wow. Well, got a little bit of this. Oh, nice. He's really going for it. Okay, look. Well, there is our Dintons. Back at it, folks. We're like the uh, Groundhog Day every single day. We always have our bike ride in the morning and our bike ride in the evening. The evening, oh, hold on, there's a bug in my eye. Hold on. Ah, oh, you freaking bug. Oh. It got me right in my eye. What the heck, okay. That got me right in my eye, guys. It flew literally right in my eye. But anyway, we're going on our bike ride in the evening. It's much better in the evening because the morning one is so hot and sunny and horrible. And it's actually quite pleasant at the moment. Other than that bug that I got in my eye, and I think there's still remainder legs in there. Oh god. What is going on here? Is there a bug left in my eye? I don't think so. I think I got it all. <gasps> nope. There it was. I got it. I knew there was still bug in there. You better watch out, beep beep! Pretty good one, actually. What? He's just telling jokes. Oh, what was it? Okay. He's a jokester lately. 
bites? Yeah. It's a nerd joke. <laughs> That's a good one, Veen. Really My camera just broke. How rude. Um, anyway, it's the following day. Um, I've just actually had a lunch meeting with the lady who redid my ring for me. So I had my engagement ring that I've had ever since Jay and I got engaged, however many years ago that was, in 2007. 2011? Yeah, 2007. I've been wearing a lot of gold and my ring was still white gold and it just really wasn't vibing. So I hadn't even been wearing my engagement ring for a super long time. And then Jay was kind of like, what the heck, dude? And I had just told him like, oh, it's just like the, the ring isn't matching like the other rings. Like I'm kind of just trying to stick with all gold. It's nothing against you. It's just like not my vibe. And um, we just kept the exact same diamond that I had initially had in my original setting. And she just made a completely new setting for me. So I went to her studio. I was able to um, kind of look at other things that she had there, like other designs and styles um, that she had already had. And then we, she kind of drew up like what I had in my mind. And I just went to lunch with her and I just got my ring. And you guys, it is so, so beautiful. I cannot even believe how pretty it is. Like it looks massive compared to what it looked like before. So. I'm just gonna show you guys. Look how gorgeous this ring is. That diamond, I know you guys will remember what my ring used to look like. It was basically just a very similar, like small band, had the four prong setting, but the ring itself, like the actual diamond, did not look this big. And so now it's just this really simple band. It is absolutely gorgeous. She did such an amazing job and then she also did the actual band so that it was hammered. So this top band that I have um, right here, this tiny little skinny one, is also from her that I got a while ago when we did um, a collab before, I think it was a couple years ago. And um, this is just one of her bands that you can just easily buy. I think it's like 300 bucks. It's just a hammered, oops, my camera is breaking. It's just a hammered band, um, gold band. And it is absolutely beautiful and I've been wearing it as a wedding band and um, that's that was always my goal was to eventually switch out my diamond so that it would be having like a matching band like the hammered band and then just have the diamond there and it is seriously amazing. Like look how big that diamond looks now. I cannot believe it and of course she like cleaned it, made it look all beautiful but look it's not like super high up. I wanted it to just be really simple and just easy to wear and not catching on anything because I hate when the prongs catch on like my sweaters or my dresses. It is absolutely stunning. I love it. So she did such a good job. I am just like blown away at how beautiful it is and she's so easy to work with as well. So if you guys are in the market to either upgrade or just kind of switch out your ring or just to actually like get a new ring in general or if you know that your your uh your bf or your gf my f oh my camera is so broken right now hello i'm right here it's not wanting to focus on me if you know that like they they might possibly be popping the question <laughs> uh, maybe give a little hint she has the most beautiful rings and she does a lot of work with like moissanite and like all different stones so not necessarily just engagement rings, but like wedding bands for him, for her, um, just regular bands. If you just want to like get a super cute ring for yourself, she's really talented and she just has such a, such a cute vibe. Like the vibes of her rings are just, they're really fab. I love them. So definitely check her out. I'm going to link her whole entire site below so you guys can just have a look. But then also I will link um, ones because she said that she has ones sitting on sale right now that are very similar to mine. Obviously mine was custom, so it's not gonna be exact, but they're you know pretty darn similar. And then she does still have these bands, just like the skinny little hammered bands um, available as well if you just wanna upgrade your band by itself or just wear them. They're really fun and she has like a lot of stacking rings, which I think is really cool. I'm really into this whole stacking like style. I love that. So got this salad. We went to Que Bueno. Um, it was amazing. It was so huge. I couldn't even like finish a third of it. So that is what I had for lunch today. I think it's just like a tortilla shell 
and then add like avocado, big slices of cucumbers, beans. It was really delish. But she gave it to me in this gorgeous little bag with um, mint tissue. And then it came in the box. And then this is the actual box that it comes in. So, sorry, the sun is like right in my thing right now, but just opens like that. And then of course she gave me my old settings. So this was the old settings. You can see it was just a little four prong little situation. And it was a little bit thicker of a band. So see, that's the difference now. So it looked way smaller in that setting, which is crazy. I don't understand like how it's possible that it's the same stone. It just like blows my mind. But this band is a little bit th thinner now. That one was a little thicker. Also, this was smooth. This one is hammered, so it has a little bit of that texture. But yeah, I'm so impressed. So Melissa Tyson Designs, if you guys have not heard of her before, amazing. She is just so talented. Go and check out her website. You guys will see all of her fabulous work. This actually shows quite a lot of the styles that you can see, so really unique, just really pretty. And she's also on Instagram. It's at Melissa Tyson Designs as well. I love watching her stories because she shows like all of the different designs that she's working on. And then she'll throw a little bit of like her kids catching little fish at the beach. Like she's super cute. So um, yes, definitely check her out if you guys have not uh, heard of her before or if you just, you know, want to see what she has to offer. And you're not a jewelry designer. You're obviously like not thinking of all these different designs, but she comes up with the most amazing designs and they're so much fun and they're like, oh wow, that's a really good idea. I never would have thought about that. So yeah, it's really cool. Hola, it's me. I'm lying down. My back is killing me today. I don't know why. I don't know if it's because I'm on my period. My period came out of nowhere. Didn't even plan on that happening. And then all of a sudden it was like, hi friend. Does that happen to anyone else where I can't hear myself when I've got these on? Um, like your back hurts more when you're on your period. I don't know if that happens to anyone else, but my back always hurts, but especially when I'm on my period. I mean, I'm sure you guys were excited to hear that comfort or that information. I am editing this video right now that you are gonna be watching. Oh, they just heard that I'm here. <laughs> the dogs, they're in their crate because they got all wet. Um, the kids and Jay have gone out. They're sh shopping for me for my birthday because my birthday is on, I don't even know when my birthday is actually. When is my birthday? I think it's on Monday or Tuesday. Monday, so in a few days. So they are out shopping for me because I had a ton of work to do, so Jay just said he'd take them out for the rest of the day and keep them busy. Um, so I've got to finish this video, and then I need to, I got half of the video done of the project that I've been working on with my friend, uh, but I still have like another, I think, hour and a half worth of footage to edit, if not more, and then I have all these photos to edit. I have a ton of stuff to do, so I need to work on that once I'm done with this. Um, but I never ended up saying goodbye or finishing off the video, so I thought I would finish it off. I've got Tittles over here at my feet. Where is he? Can you guys see him? He's like all flopped down. Winky! Wink! Where's my hand? There we go. Wink! Oh, he's out. These nails are another press-on. Kiss press-on nails. Got a lot of compliments on them on Instagram. They're literally the Kiss acrylic glue-on stick-on nails for $8 that you get at Walgreens. I actually really want to try Red Aspen. I think I'm going to give them a go because they have some really cute designs right now. And I'm kind of like running out of options at Walgreens and I kind of want to switch it up. Okay, I'm going to go let my dogs out. They're driving me insane right now. This is what happens. They go outside, they get soaking wet, and then we got to put them in their crate because otherwise they'll jump all over our couch and our couch is cream. Look at him. Oh, he's so tired. Wink. Winky. Wink. Oh. Oh, you just, oh, he's so sweet. You guys are, look, you guys are despicably dirty from playing out and then, see, this is what they would do. They jump all over the couch and then they would get it filthy. Do you need to go potty? Come on. Let's go outside, but let's not get wet. Oh yeah, she's gonna go potty. Good girl. Good girl, Neoni. You gonna go, Posy? Posy, come on. Go potty, baby. Is she gonna do it? Oh, good girl. Good girl. You wanna go in? Come on. Let's not get wet. Good girls. Thank you. They're very good. She's actually been really easy to potty train, Posy. 
Fiona took a little longer, but now she's over a year, so she's all good. She's done really well. She potty trained really fast. Look at her. She's such a cute baby. She's such a cute baby. Sit. Sit. No, you have to sit. 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 No. Oh, good girl. Fiona, sit. 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 Good girl. Oh, now you want a treat? Oh, do you want a treat? Okay. Come on then. Come on. Let's get your treats. Are you excited? Are you excited? My friends gave me this. They have, they get the bark box and they had a ton of extra snacks. So they gave them to us and the kids, or the kids, the, um, the babies love these. Are you guys ready? Oh look, Posey's already sitting. She's so well behaved. Fiona, you gotta sit baby. Oh, he wants one too. You've never had one of these, Wink. Who do you think you are, a dog all of a sudden? Sit. Oh, good girl, you're up, uh, Fiona. No. Po ah. Posey, this is for you. Fiona, you need to sit, don't be rude. Fiona, sit. Good girl, there you go. It's a dog treat, I don't think you're even allowed to. He's like, no, I'm not interested in that. Well, anyway, guys, I'm gonna call it a day. How did you like the hummingbird? She graced us with her presence twice. Did you guys see that? I did a slow-mo situation of it where um, when I was doing the watering of all the plants, she came up. I don't know if you guys caught it, but I was so excited that that was there. And then she came up again and we caught her. So that was so exciting because she's like, whoa, why is it so bright? She is the love of my little life, my hummingbird life. I don't know. What's going on? The sun is shining right in here. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. I cannot believe that she came twice and I actually got it on camera. That makes me so happy. Um, but yes, I am taking a, my skin, oh my gosh, you guys. So I have not broken out for so, so long. I went to Tahoe, my skin broke out so bad and I'm still recovering. Like they're all just scars at this point. But my neck literally broke out like how it used to when I lived there. So now I'm like, is my skin allergic to Tahoe? I don't know if it's because the water is so pure there or if it's because of the salt water here. I don't know what's going on, but my skin was freaking out. So now, luckily, I'm left with some scars, but it's better than big old pimples. Don't forget to check out the Care Of. I will link them down below. Don't forget to use that code, you guys. Samantha50 will save you 50% off of your first order. So a huge thank you to Care Of for partnering that portion of the video. And uh, yes, I hope you guys all enjoy. Have a wonderful day. Um, this is Thursday, so I probably, I don't know when this will actually be going up, but. Um, whatever day it is, happy day. I hope you guys all are having a fabulous one and I'll see you guys in my next video. I love you. Bye.